Hey, I'm Ron Drodos from KeyboardImprov.com, and for my 25th jazz piano tip, I'd like to look at the tune Autumn Leaves in the real book and show you something that I learned when I was Jerry Mulligan's assistant, great jet baritone saxophonist. I remember hearing him play every night, and he would use these melodic sequences where he would play something like, you know, nice melody, and then he'd play it down a step usually with a little variation in his case, but I was really envious of that because it sounded so wonderful and it just flowed out of his saxophone. And I sat down at the piano, I couldn't really do it too well, but um, eventually figured it out. I like to pass that along to you. When you're um, playing a tune like Autumn Leaves, it's really easy because you have these pairs of chords, A minor to D, and then, which goes up a fourth, and then down a whole st uh, a step, the same thing, you know, G to C, same chord movement down another step, F sharp to B. So each of those pairs can be a similar melody just down one step in the, in the G scale or however you want to look at it. So you could play something like this over A minor to D. And then you do the same thing down a step over the G to C. And then the same thing down another step. See, it gives a logic and coherence to your solos, and it's a lot of fun. And uh, it's very melodic, too. So check that out. Melodic sequences on autumn leaves. Good luck with your playing. I'll see you in the next jazz piano tip.